Hello. Have you ever seen a pencil? Of course you have. There are many, many different kinds of pencils. They're not all the same, are they? Later on, have a look at how many different pencils you can find. There are pencils for different jobs. Hard ones for writing, soft ones for drawing, and lots of different coloured ones for art and decoration. What a dull place it would be if there were no colours in our pictures. Did you know that the middle of a pencil is made up of a mixture of graphite, clay and water? And then it's inserted into a wooden sleeve. From time to time the graphite in the centre of the pencil needs to be helped out. And so we have, yes, the pencil sharpener. There is also another fantastically wonderful thing about a pencil that I'm sure you realise. If you make a mistake, and who doesn't, with the help of a rubber or an eraser, you can rub out that mistake and start again. What is really important about a pencil is what's in the middle, the inside. Whatever the colour, whether it is soft or hard, it needs to be able to do what it was made for. Yes, it will need the help of an eraser and a sharpener to be able to fulfil its function successfully. And the world is such a better place with all our different pencils. Did you realise that we are a bit like the pencil? We are a mixture of our parents' genes, our personality and our abilities mixed with love. We all look different. We all can serve useful purposes and make the world a better and more colourful place. And yes, we all do make mistakes, but it is possible for us to correct them. How? By being sorry and learning from them. And yes, we all need helping to get the best out of ourselves, a sort of sharpening, by listening to advice, and learning from others. Christians believe that we are like a huge, glorious box of pencils made up of God's love. He gave Jesus to be an eraser for our mistakes and the Holy Spirit to be our guide and sharpener. But we are all different, aren't we? Now I'm going to say a prayer and please join in and say Amen at the end if you would like to. Dear Lord, we thank you for our friends and family. Help us to appreciate and look after each other in the same way as you look after and care for us. Amen. Why not take a pencil and write a story or a poem or make a picture using light and dark shading or colour a picture? And when you do, why not give a thought about the human pencils you know, your parents, teachers, friends, and keep them in the picture. Bye for now.